Just seen our first frost, which uh, yeah. for a lot of people that can mean the end of allergy season and for others, well, it's a year round struggle. Hard to even determine the culprit. <sighs> yes, it is. And WSAD's Lisa Feinstein spoke to an allergist about a form of testing that you may not even know about. The seasons are getting longer and pollen is blooming later, leaving many of us sneezing and sniffling later in the year. Whether it's pollen you're allergic to, insects, or even food, you can find out what's causing your reactions with a blood test. That is a possible method by which we can do allergy testing. It is, as of now, a regular blood draw, typically done in a hospital or a lab. Allergist Megan Shepard says many are familiar with the test that involves pricking your skin to see what gets a reaction. Blood testing is a method allergy sufferers may not know about. Skin testing has been out longer, but it has been possible to look at allergy in the blood since the 60s. What information allergists use from the blood draw is something called IgE. Which is the um, protein in your body that's an antibody that facilitates the allergic reaction. Shepard says while a prick test identifies allergic reactions, the blood draw test can get even more specific. So for instance, for certain foods like peanut, we can break that down into the pieces of the peanut protein to which people react and that can give us a little bit more diagnostic information. You may see ads online for kits to test your allergies at home. Shepard says these tests are not accurate as they don't flag for the right things. It will often show positivities to things that you often consume because that's something your body sees a lot. And so that gets misinterpreted as being a problem when it actually is literally just showing that your body remembers seeing that. When trying to find answers for your allergies, it's best to rely on information and testing from a certified allergist. Lisa Feinstein, WSAZ. Now, the blood draw testing is a good option for those who are unable to go off their allergy medication for testing or those who are looking for more specific answers.